Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. I'm sorry about the lighting. I'm actually currently editing the video and I've decided to call this series my Fitness Friday series. So make sure that you come back every single Friday. I will upload the workouts and everything that I did from the week before and I'm kind of committing to this with not only not only me but also my trainer Frankie to document this whole series. I'm hoping for all of 2022 that's kind of the plan so I'm really really excited to start this new fitness Fridays series and yeah I just wanted to come on here and let you guys know before I kept talking and this is actually very weird for me because I'm going to my training session right now with Frankie I just opened up my Alani new energy drink this flavor is the Hawaiian shaved ice it's my favorite and this is a little weird because I don't know if you guys have been following me for a while now, but I used to go to training sessions like at 6 a.m. And so I would be out like at 5.40 and there wouldn't be anybody out here. But now my training sessions have changed from Tuesdays and Thursdays to Monday, Wednesdays and Fridays at 11 a.m. Which is definitely, I feel like, throwing off my routine or the past routine that I had in 2021. Which is, I think, a good thing because we're now in 2022 and I feel like this is going to make me adjust and to switch things out in my routine that maybe weren't working out for me and to all in all just be more productive so i just wanted to make this little intro because i'm on my way like i mentioned to my training because one of my goals for 2022 was to work out with my trainer three times a week aside from that i do want to do other stuff like hiking maybe try out yoga or anything like that but i haven't really looked into it just yet because i've been sick as well i was sick last week oh this is much better but yeah, so I'm gonna drink. I don't drink all of this to be honest per session. Oh, this is so good. I usually just do half of it. I also have my water here, of course, and I'm excited. What we're going to do today, I think, I don't know as far as workout, but he told me to come a little bit earlier, which I'm not coming that much earlier, but we're gonna do some measurements so that we kind of have that to work with and to look at, which I've actually, if you guys don't know, I'll talk a little bit more about it, I think maybe after, but my fitness journey has been not crazy, I would say, but I will tell you guys that in the past, I don't know, like four or five months, five months that I've been living in my new apartment here in LA, I've actually lost around like 20 pounds, which is crazy. That's really crazy for me. And I think a lot of it has to do with not only the training sessions, but also my eating habits and all of that. So I'll definitely try. I'm not sure how this video is going to pan out, but I just wanted to film this intro now. Maybe I'll include a few days of workouts and then maybe even like food that I eat. I'm not sure. I'm still thinking about it. But yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you have any questions specifically about my fitness journey in the comments down below. And I'll most likely film a Q&A in the future. So let me know if you have any questions or anything you want to say. And I hope you guys like this video. Different type of video. I am so good at pretending Smiling in my tiny bubble Like a moment without ending Spending time like it was going backwards
so I don't, I don't think I'm going to come on here like every time I'm done with my training session, but I just want to come on here because I was looking through the footage and I realized like how skinny I look. And I feel like I was telling this to, to my boyfriend. I was like, I feel like my gains are all gone. And just looking through the footage, like I realized like how I kind of look scrawny and which is okay. Like I'm trying to like, you know, document this for you guys and see like my progress. I did take some like before pictures. Hello guys and welcome back. Today is day two of our fitness journey. I'm still not sure what I'm calling this video, but I got a haircut yesterday. I know this is like not like fitness related at all. And I have a middle part currently, which I never usually do, but I'm kind of feeling it. Of course, my hair is going to probably get sweaty, so it's not going to look as cute after the workout, but I thought we would give her a little shout out. So I'm on my way to my training session. It is Wednesday, and I'm not going to lie. This schedule is kind of throwing everything off like i feel like my schedule has been thrown off specifically because i changed days not only days but the time that i come to work out now so it's taking me a little bit to adjust i mean it's only like the second day that i'm doing this but i'm struggling guys not gonna lie i'm really really struggling but i'm excited for today i know i didn't come on here which i think i'll do it to, i'm not sure if today or maybe because my sister and Joel are gonna come and work with me. Talk a little bit about like my measurements, just so you guys have an idea of what I'm starting with. As well as Frankie actually shared this whole notes like game plan for me that he has created. So this week, the goal was to work out every single day. And I'm this is probably gonna sound like me making up an excuse, but yesterday I got a flat tire and that was like a whole thing within itself so unfortunately i wasn't able to do what i was supposed to do which was the 100 body weight squats 40 minute walk and mobility so i wasn't able to do that so i put a little x so i put a little x right here for tuesday but today wednesday it says that we're supposed to be doing something knee dominant pool and core which i'm always up for core i love working out my core so i'm excited for today's workouts and i'll bring you guys along with me Sixth. You're killing me, Larry. I'm so dead such a good workout uh, I was talking to Frankie how like about my schedule and how it's like super different than before and how now I'm like thinking like wow like my week's not over because usually I don't even work Tuesdays and Thursdays and I still have Friday so it's like wow like I still have Friday to come to which is gonna be nice it's a nice change and I honestly feel great every time I work out So yeah, I'm good morning. Leave. Today is Friday. And today I'm gonna go to my third workout this week. I'm not sure if I'm gonna separate this into three, into like weekly parts. But for now, this is going to be week one, if that makes sense. I'm here, I'm getting ready to go to my training session right now with Frankie. And I feel very sore. Sadly, I haven't been able to do the extra physical exercises that Frankie had listed for me. So I feel really bad about that. So hopefully I'm able to do them this weekend. But I've been having kind of a rough week. I know I mentioned that I got a flat tire. And then 
on Wednesday, I got another flat tire, which thankfully my sister and my um, brother-in-law came over. So he was able to get that fixed up for me, but this week has not been my week for sure. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna drink one of these cold pressed juices from Suja Organic. And obviously these are not like the healthiest things ever, but this is I think one of the healthiest ones this brand has, only 80 calories. So it's not bad. So I'm going to drink this as like my pre-workout like breakfast, I guess. And then I'm going to have my energy drink and then I'll come back, probably have a smoothie. If I don't end up making a smoothie, I might actually end up buying a smoothie from the cafe by the gym because I don't have like groceries and stuff having on grocery shopping. So I'll most likely end up getting a protein shake from there and then come back, maybe eat like, I don't know, like eggs with spinach. And then get to work and then that's gonna be the first week i have to come back on here and talk to you guys about like my numbers and everything so that's how i'll end the video talking about like my measurements and all of that so let me go ahead and get to drinking this and then i'll take you guys to today's workout <laughs> You got eight calories, fam. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, let's get it. Give me eight good ones. Come on, speed it up. Go, go, go. Faster. Work it, work it, work it, work it, work it, work it, work it. Oh yeah. Hey, Asus, real quick. This is for her vlog. You gotta give me two tips for a general pop to get into the gym this new year. Two quick tips. Just move. Make your focus to go into the gym 30 minutes and move. 30 minutes, all right. That's the tip. How you feeling? Great. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, now we got a minute break. guys i'm done with my friday workout and i've honestly got to say that i'm trying to get out of here by the way which is kind of a struggle because i have to um kind of have to do the most here but it's okay we got it anyways so maybe i should do this first and then talk huh so yeah i've had a couple of minutes to recover from that especially because um i stopped by the cafe next to the gym it's called dialogue and i got the dating dialogue which this reminds me <laughs> of um going with paula after our 6 a.m workout <laughs> and i miss paula so much um if you guys know paula's my friend she's actually the one who introduced me to lucky athletes the gym that i go to here in west hollywood and now i'm training by myself because she's still doing tuesdays and thursdays but she's coming in the in the evening now which that's a little bit 
like too like inconvenient i think for my schedule and I'm, even like this time i'm trying to still adjust like i mentioned um but yeah that just reminded me of paula but i've had quite a few minutes to recover from my workout this is probably the toughest workout i've had in a really long time and i'm still like like a little like shook maybe it was the energy drink too but i had such a good workout you guys would have seen the clips by now but i was kind of struggling at times and frankie just kept adding more and more weight so thanks for that frankie appreciate you and that's kind of the main reason why i love coming to my um training sessions because i have frankie there to kind of push me to do more whereas if i were going to the gym alone well, I used to have a gym membership and I still wouldn't go. So I kind of love that I have Frankie there to kind of hype me up and help me do more than, than what I would do if I was alone. So I really, really like today. I'm probably going to go home, talk a little bit about like my measurements and whatnot. And that's going to be the end of this video. But yeah, let me recover a little bit more, drive home, and then I'll come back to and I am back. I'm not sure how much I like this angle, but this is kind of what we have to work with today um i just wanted to come on here and end week one's video i just actually finished editing it and i'm getting ready to go to my training session today i promised that i was going to give you guys measurements so like i mentioned in the video frankie created and i'm sorry about the background noise frankie created game plan or he's calling it a playbook so in here i have things like nutrition i have mental fitness body analytics um, general info and daily deposits which that's kind of something that Frankie really does is kind of focuses on making sure that you are working out every single day and that's kind of like your daily deposit so what I've been doing is I've been writing down every single thing that I eat on a daily basis that's for the nutrition part then mental fitness for the first week I believe it was don't hit snooze on your alarm which I think I got four or five out of the seven days which is really good and then for the body analytics my before pictures that i took i believe the first day i was back so i'm gonna pop them up here i have three pictures here that frankie took of me and this is gonna be great to compare to future weeks and then for measurements just so i have this like documented my quads are currently 23 inches my hips are 38 and three quarters my waist is 31 and my bicep is 11 inches so those are my measurements and then we did this in body test on monday and we're actually doing this every single monday i believe now and essentially it just gives you like your weight your skeletal muscle mass and your body fat percentage so the first time i did this was back in november so i can kind of compare to those numbers from november to january the third which is when i did this again i lost about four pounds so i was 136.3 and on my first week i was 132.4 then my skeletal muscle mass went from 48.5 to 47.2 and my body fat percentage went from 35.2 to 34.8 so he did make me like write out a goal and i couldn't really think of many so i have one which is bring my body fat percentage down to 31 percent i don't know how hard that will be but we're gonna go ahead and see and that's kind of my goal for march of 2022 i'm still thinking of another fitness goal that i would like to achieve i just wanted to be specific so that's that so yeah that's kind of what i wanted to talk about at the end of this video of course it is only the first week so there is so much more to come so many more exercises and honestly so far i have already seen a change in my body and just my confidence and my energy and i all around just feel a lot better so i really do enjoy going to my training sessions with my trainer frankie i will definitely go ahead and leave all of his social medias down below i believe he has instagram youtube tiktok as well as i will also leave the gym that i go to which is lucky athletes i'll leave their instagram down below as well so make sure you go check them out show frankie some love tell him i sent you i don't know if i mentioned this but i've been working out with frankie since september and i honestly just feel like my quality of life and how i feel has just changed tremendously and i'm so excited to see what else 22 has in store for me so yeah very very excited to be vlogging this journey with you guys and as always if you enjoyed this video please do not forget to give it a huge thumbs up as well as subscribe to my channel for more content and hopefully i will see you guys on the next one bye guys